Sedgwick Grafter Slide is a useful tool and there's a couple of knacks to get the most out of it. First I keep my slide in fresh water with a bit of soap or bleach and then when I take it out just wipe it off around the edges and the back of the slide. I never touch the gridded surface where we put the sample. That scratches really easily so you don't want to actually touch that with anything. Then I take the cover slide, dry it off, and place it on top of the slide. I'm going to fill it from the corners, so you put it on sort of diagonal. Take the sample, shake it up a little bit. You don't have to shake it up a lot. Just upend it so you get the cells all mixed up. And take the pipette, squeeze in and out a couple of times. And then start to fill the slide from the corner. Squeeze slowly and hold the pipette as close to horizontal as you can. As you fill the slide and bring the cover slide around and there you have your sample. Put it on the microscope to settle for three to five minutes. That allows most of the sample to settle out and then you can scan it and see everything that's there. If you don't have a glass pipette, no problem, plastic one works just as good. You just squeeze it in again, keeping nice, nice and close to horizontal and squeezing in the corner. Bring the top slide around and put it to settle. Now sometimes you're not quite as steady handed as you might want to be. Maybe a little too much coffee in the morning, got the shakes. so. You don't have to fill the slide on the stage of the microscope. You can fill it beside the microscope. Just put it down on a piece of paper towel or other paper. And again, with your pipette as close to horizontal as possible, fill it from the corners and bring the top slide around. Wipe it off if you've spilt anything. Add a little bottom a little wipe and put it on your microscope to settle. When you're done with looking at your samples, empty it out and then spray it off with a fresh water spray bottle. You can get into all the corners so it's you know the optimum way of cleaning off the slide. But if you don't have a spray bottle, you can just put it under the tap and then put it back in your jar of fresh water with a bit of soap and or bleach in it.